Hi, welcome to Teach Me K channel. Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Google Maps offline on your Android phones. This is a very useful feature that can save you battery, mobile data and help you navigate when you don't have internet access. Before we start, please make sure to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon to get notified of my new videos. Also give this video a thumbs up if you find it really helpful. So why would you want to use Google Maps offline? Well, there are many situations where you might need it. For example, if you're traveling to a new place where internet is slow, expensive or unavailable, you can download an area from Google Maps to your phone and use it when you are offline. Or if you are in a remote area where network coverage is poor or unreliable, you can still get directions and find places with offline maps. Or if you just want to save some battery and mobile data, you can set up offline maps and still use other apps with mobile data so let's get started i will show you in the video how to download an area from google maps it's very easy now let's see how i can download an area from google maps first let me open my google maps application on my phone once i open up the google maps app on my phone make sure you are connected to the internet and signed in into the google maps and then search for a place which you want to download so for example if i want to download any place like this i'll just search for the place of that location which i want to download the google maps for so once i search you need to just scroll this over and then you need to select the three dots that you see at the top right and here so which is basically a more option so once you click on those three dots you will see an option here called as download offline map just click on that and now it is showing you the place which you have searched for in the rectangular box here so if you want to select this particular map for your download you can click on the download option or the button that is seen in the bottom right and here and it is also showing you how much space it would consume or it would require on your phone or if you want to be specific with any particular city then you can also search by that place name so i search here one of the city or the place that i want to particularly download for then I'll just scroll this over and then click on the three dots which you see at the top right and here. Then I will start downloading. And now this is showing me how much space it would be consuming to download. So now let me click on the download option here. Once I click on download, the map starts downloading in the background. So that's how the download has started for this particular place that I have started downloading. So let me show you how the download progresses and once it is downloaded, I will show you where it is being saved. That's it. You have just downloaded an offline map of uh, Krakow city. You can repeat this process for any other place that you want to download. Now, let me show you how do you use offline maps. To demonstrate that, let me turn off the location now. And to use the Google Maps offline after you have downloaded a particular area or a place, you can use the Google Maps app just as normally you would do. Now, in case if your interconnection is slow or absent, 
or you are not able to get any sort of uh, connection for your maps just use the google maps as you would but when you have downloaded google maps offline go to the profile icon that is here at the top right hand here and click on offline maps menu and once you have clicked on that you will see the map that you have downloaded the list of the maps that you have downloaded here so now under the downloaded maps heading the second option is the one which i have downloaded so now let me click on that so this is the place that you have downloaded now i will click on the map and this is how it would look like now in this what you can do is you can get directions and it can show routes and you can use the navigation as you want to and by searching for the locations with offline maps let me click on go option and click on search here let me search one of the places So this is my search location so now if i want to get the directions so to go to this location let me select the start location and show you how it would look like so that's it this is how you could be able to drive to your directions or the locations from your start points to the destination locations and this is how it is showing from where you could start and where you could reach your destination and this is how it looks like when you start using the drive option you could also use the preview option here and it shows you direction by direction how you can go and reach your particular destination So this is how with the turn by turn options you will be able to reach your destination. But however some features are unavailable when you use offline maps such as if you click on this option the features like public transport, traffic, bike, bicycling, 3D, street view, wildfires, air quality and all these features are unavailable in offline maps these would require internet connection whenever you use maps i hope this uh, using offline maps would give you a lot of help in a way when you have very less amount of internet connection and you are in or either your internet connection is very slow or absent this would be very helpful feature for you i hope this google maps offline usage on your android phones was really helpful for you i hope this video was very useful to you if you have any questions or suggestions please leave them in the in the comment section of my video thank you for watching and see you in the next video thank you bye bye